You are watching C Farm TV House of Prayer.
say come Ndiyo maana kana sema to. Let us reason together. Njo tuseme hapa pamoja. Mungu anasema hivi. When I was working, nilikuwa nafanya kazi. I was working in KCC. Nilikuwa nafanya kazi kwa Mombasa. KCC Mombasa. I was working as a tan boy. Nilikuwa kama tan boy. Then after some times, baada ya muda, you know Mombasa is very hot. Unajua Mombasa ni hot. I told God, kuna joto sana nikamwambia Mungu. I want to become a salesman. Nikamwambia nataka kuwa muuzaji, mfanye biashara ya muuzaji. I got that chance to become a salesman. Nikapata hiyo nafasi ya kuwa muuzaji. After some time, ndio mfanye biashara. After some times, baada ya muda, I was sweating so much out there. Nilikuwa natoa jasho sana pale nyumbani. I said to God, lakini neno nikasema kwa Mungu. Nikamwambia Mungu, God, Mungu, I also want to work in the office. Nikamwambia Mungu nataka pia kufanya kazi where there's air condition mahali kuna when I and someone bring some tea at 10 na mahali ambapo mtu atakuletea chai saa 4 and I could sit there and I could pray and I believe to God na nisukumze na Mungu one day siku I got a memo nikapata memo and I was told you are supposed to work in the office nikaambiwa unataka ume unahitajika kufanya kazi ofisini but the people in the office lakini watu wa ofisini they were wondering wanashanga I don't have a seat at table mimi sina sina kitu kwenye kwenye wale do I care pale do I care yes he is for me maybe mimi sijali he will create a space for me huyu Mungu aliyeweka huyu shaka atatengeneza mali but command them to create a space for me Mungu alisababisha nipate space and I was there working there niwe nikawa pale nafanya kazi and guess what na mko kwa Mungu the guy was cooking tea for us what Mungu anapotupikia chai he was learning than me alikuwa ule alikuwa anatupikia chai alikuwa amesoma kuliko mimi hadi leo Amen. Because if I tell you where I reach, you can't believe me. Niki mwambia mali nimetoka, niki mwambia mali nimetoka utaniamini. I remember the, 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 the letter I wrote to a friend of mine in America. It happened at a time I, I saw in my box and I was reading and I was asking myself, na huyu mzungu alielewa niliongea nini kweli? Nikawa nasoma. Because it was a broken English. Eh. Hallelujah. Amen. God can do it. Mungu anaweza kufanya. I say God can do it. Nasema Mungu anaweza kufanya. When I went to that office, nilipoenda kwenye ofisi, I didn't know how to read in English. Mimi sikujua kuzungumza Kiingereza. But I used to buy a news nation newspaper not Taifa ya leo. Eh, nilikuwa nanunua gazeti la Kiingereza sio Taifa. I didn't know how to read. Lakini sikujua kusoma. My Bible was King James original. Eh, mabibi yangu ilikuwa King James original. And I didn't know how to read. Na sikujua namna ya kusoma. But I told God, lakini nilimwambia Mungu, you have to teach me how to read. Mnikamwambia Mungu, nifundishe namna ya kusoma. Kwa nini? Because the Bible says so. Sababu Biblia inasema. Bible says, Biblia inasema. In the book of I am Psalm chapter 50. Eh, Zaburi 50. Verse 4. Mstari wa 4. The Bible says, Biblia inasema. And God will give you the tongue. Mungu atakupatia language one. Ulimsho that you can speak like that. So that you can hear in words of Christian. Like those of you taught. You know. That the word challenged me. You know li 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 li. I started reading. Take a show. Make a look so much. Take a look. Take a look so much so much. And it's your day. Bagadeo. English is not a problem to me. It can get us a social media problem. Huh? Huh? And I was a failure. Na nilikuwa God does not look at your failure. Nilikuwa nimeangua kwa does not look at your failure. Mungu angalie as looking at your heart. He's looking at your failure. He's looking for a man or a woman. Angalie mwanamke What they believe. Kwa kile wanachoa. Not on the circumstances. Sio hali ilivyo. Because the circumstances will just put us down. Lakini hali ilivyo itakuwa kando itakuwa chini. I was born in a poor family. Nimezaliwa kwenye jamii maskini. That's what they, the worst that came from Gideon. Hiyo ndio neno lilikuja kwa Gideon. We are just the least. Kwa maisha ya Gideon mimi we are not people we are not a big family. Sisi ni watu wachache. Who says that you are big or you are small? Go to. God 
kuhumba ni kuhumba kwa mtana Haleluya Haleluya Sometimes when it rained, we used to stand because we had a house of Yanyasi. Eh, so that we can sleep. Sometimes he would go in Genesha, then he goes out. Eh, and then we would look those Migomba and these who turn up up so that we. Hallelujah. They despised us. Our family, whenever they used to have things, we were not involved. Since we were looked as nothing. Let me tell you. Today, today, without my word. Because you are rising again. You are rising again. When God has lifted you, even the people despise you, they will come to you. They will call you Meshimiwa. Because God has remembered you. God remembers you. Everybody will see. When is it my sin? I used to call them. I used to call when I want to go out. Sin is Meshimiwa. My God. I wanted money. But what is it for sin? But then, I will tell you. 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 That's my sister. Yeah. And when they come to you, they say, yeah. Can I have your number? Do you remember when you were toiling? When you were toiling, nobody came to you. Nobody wanted to see you. Have you seen a beggar? A beggar. If they have a good advice, they will come to you. Nobody listened to them. Okay. That's why we need God to bless us. So that people can come to us. Nobody can go to a beggar. Hallelujah. But when the time has come, that God has lifted you. You are high. You are beggar. Can I have your number? Where do you live? I would like to visit you. God has remembered you. People look for you. Don't look for the symbol from people. Look it from from above. Focus your eyes unto God. I say, focus your eyes unto God. Eh, I never give up. Am I talking to somebody? Now, Hallelujah. He will raise you. Amen. 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 Amen.
Jesus loves you. Wale, wale, wale marikia, na bala, na wale, 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 wakubwa. Because the God that we are covering eh, mungu is a big God. Ni mungu. You are watching CFOM TV House of Prayer.